Rebecca's Lucky Charm. Recently, the Fat Controller had ordered a whole fleet of new engines to the island of Sodor. And Rebecca, the big yellow tender engine, is one of them. Woo woo woo! <laughs> she is big and her paint is very yellow. She has eight wheels on her front chassis and four wheels for her back chassis. So all to together, Rebecca has 12 wheels. <laughs> she also likes to surprise the other engines. She whistled past Edward. Oh. Hello, Edward. Edward jumped and surprised. Bust my buffers, he tooted. <laughs> Hello, Henry, she whistled. Henry puffed past proudly. <laughs> Hello, Rebecca, he toot toot to the back. Rebecca is a very cheery engine. Rebecca puffed to the yards. <laughs> Surprise, Rosie, she whistled happily. <laughs> Surprise, Thomas, whistled Rebecca. <laughs> And that night, the other engines were very eager to hear all about Rebecca and her adventures. Ah, so what was it like for you on the New York Railway, asked James excitedly. Ah, uh, it was fun, whistled Rebecca. I remember this one time, my friend Cody and I were racing. We were racing to the bottom of the hill. I was pulling fast, but Cody was just as fast as I was, and he soon overtook me. But with my lucky charm in hand, I was able to win the race. I pulled ahead of Cody, and he was soon in despair. And I arrived to the finish line first. Cody arrived seconds later. Tired but triumphant, he congratulated me on my win. And I only won thanks to my good old lucky charm. The other engines were excited to hear more about Rebecca and her lucky charm. But Percy wasn't. He was cross. Lucky charm? Lucky charm? Huh, don't talk to me about lucky charms, said Percy. Don't. Just don't do it. He scowled crossly. The other engines were very surprised. <laughs> Rebecca was shocked herself. Never mind him, said James. Let's hear more, whistled Emily. I want to added Thomas. Me as well, whistled Edward. I'd like to hear more, agreed Toby, Billy, Philip, Dan, Hero, and Gordon. So they all talked long into the evening about Rebecca's days before Sodor. And early into the morning, too. <laughs> Rebecca was still going on about her lucky charm. And Percy was still cross. Hmm. <laughs> Rebecca puffed along the beautiful countryside with her train of trucks. <laughs> Spencer was waiting at a junction. Rebecca pulled up alongside him. Hello, said Spencer. I'm Spencer. Who are you? I'm Rebecca. Pleased to meet you. I heard you're a slow engine, said Spencer. Would you like to race me? You're on, said Rebecca. I'll win anyway. They both waited for the signal to drop. After the signal drops, they both sped away. <laughs> Rebecca pulled ahead. I'm going to win. I'm going to win, she whistled. But Spencer pulled through quicker. <laughs> Rebecca and Spencer thundered down the hill. Rebecca was remembering her race with Cody on her old railway. And just then, her lucky charm came loose. Rebecca's lucky charm was gone. Spencer pulled ahead just as Rebecca stopped. He didn't stop. He kept on going. <laughs> Rebecca realized she had lost her lucky charm. Now what shall I do? I've lost the race and my lucky charm. I'm not a winner anymore. At last, Rebecca arrived at the seaside. <laughs> she thought she was on time, but she was wrong. Captain Joe and the lighthouse keeper walked over. They were very cross with her. Rebecca, we understand you are new, but that doesn't mean you should be late, they said. But I thought, I thought I was on time, she stuttered. 
But you're wrong, said Captain Joe. You are very late, said the lighthouse keeper. I knew it just as I thought. My luck is running out just after I lose my lucky charm, she pouted sadly. Rebecca left her cars and pulled away. Lucky charm? What nonsense! Mm -hmm. Rebecca began to look for her lucky charm and retrace her steps and look other places. Rosie and Duck were in the yards. Woo, woo, woo. Just when Rebecca pulled in. Excuse me, she steamed. Have either of you seen... A gray horseshoe, she stammered. No, I haven't, said Rosie. Have you, Duck? Oh, I haven't seen the matter of it either. Now go away. We're busy working. <laughs> Rebecca was disheartened. Um, thanks anyway, she said. <laughs> Where could her lucky charm be? She puffed to the steamworks. <laughs> Excuse me, have any of you seen a lucky charm? The other engines just looked at her with stupid expressions. <laughs> I'm sorry, Rebecca, said Connor. We haven't seen any. In case you are wondering, said Frida, we'd like for you to leave now. Rebecca was sad. <laughs> Rebecca huffed across the island trying to find her lucky charm. But she couldn't find it anywhere. <laughs> Rebecca puffed into the Homestead Hollow yard. Maybe it's here, she said. <laughs> but she wasn't paying attention to where she was going. The points weren't set for her line, and she raced straight into the sheds. <laughs> she burst out the other side. <laughs> the other engines were very shocked. <laughs> Sorry, she smiled sadly. <laughs> Rebecca whizzed into a tunnel, and she thundered out the other side, trying to find her lucky horseshoe. She didn't see the danger ahead. <laughs> Rebecca whizzed right into the loose buffers. <laughs> the loose buffers were out of sight. <laughs> Rebecca hung dangerously over the edge until Henry arrived with Harvey the crane engine and as Henry helped Rebecca back onto the rails Sir Topham had arrived. He was cross. Rebecca, you did not do as I was told. You came late to the seaside and you burst through the Humpstead Hollow engine sheds which will take weeks to repair. And you broke the set of buffers that were here, and burst right into the rock slide that Harvey and Ross were already on their way to clean. You must take care more. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Apologize, Rebecca. She was sorry. That night, Rebecca explained what happened to the other engines. I just wanted to find my good luck charm, she said. Rebecca, said Edward, there's no such thing as good luck. Good luck? comes from your positive attitude, and bad luck comes from a negative one like James, Gordon, or Henry's. James and Gordon were upset. Uh -huh -huh. That's why I got upset yesterday, said Percy, because I had an experience with good luck and bad luck one day. Well, said Rebecca, in future I should listen to you, and I will have a positive attitude, she said. But right there lay her lucky charm. Mm -mm -mm -mm.